So when, if you want to know, if you want to be like God, if, you're, if your stance is I'm being like God and I'm helping out others and I have forgiveness and I'm standing in the gap and I'm doing all these things, good, be like God, but God doesn't do it until we learn. God doesn't do it until we repent. God doesn't do it until we change our ways. If you're not waiting for anyone to learn or change their ways, you're just enabling them. Amen? And when you enable people, you're circumventing the laws of God, which are going to cause problems in your life over and over again. Let me explain this to you right now. When we circumvented that as a nation, when we allowed people to eat or have money that did not work, we violated this law. We stood in front of them getting the consequence for the actions of not working, right? And because we did that, we created a problem that lasts longer, things that we have to backtrack on, that we have to change, that we have to get back to there. But let me tell you why they did it. Do you know why they did the stimulus? They did the stimulus because if you stop spending money, the economy crashes. So what they wanted to do was to give you money so that you would buy it on Amazon and have it delivered to your house. Okay, because if you spend money, then the economy can keep churning. So listen to this very clearly. They didn't give you stimulus checks because they cared about you. They gave you stimulus checks to protect the economy. Okay, they were protecting themselves. Not you. They enabled you and caused you to be stunted in your growth because they wanted to keep the economy. 